Autonomy in unmanned systems is a very complex beast. It involves a lot of things, and as humans, we take things for granted. We can make decisions on our own, but to encode those with a computer is a completely different field of study. And especially in aerial systems, there's layers of autonomy. There's control systems that control the lowest level attitude of the vehicle. There are navigation systems that control which direction the vehicle is pointing and where it's going. And then on top of that, there are decision-making systems that make sure that your autonomous system doesn't fly into an aircraft or a building or land. The challenge is stacking up all of those layers of autonomy in a way that not only maintains a safe vehicle operation, but also enables users of the system to do what they want. My dad is a, an auto mechanic, he fixes cars. We're always building things together. My mom was a computer programmer on the other side, and so she got me into programming. I, I used to write little programs on my TI-83 calculator, and that's actually what I consider how I learned to code. I went to MIT to study aerospace engineering, and I got a bachelor's, a master's, and then stayed for a PhD. Airware is building a platform for commercial drone operations. Commercial drones need to be safe, they need to be reliable, they need to be customizable to the wealth of commercial applications that they're applicable to. Things like infrastructure inspection and search and rescue and atmospheric satellites and applications that we haven't even thought of today. And the only way to possibly address them all is with a platform. A platform enables you to tailor the unmanned system to the specific application that you care about. As CTO of Airware, I marry the long-term technical vision of autonomy and capability for unmanned systems with a near-term product that will be useful to customers today. This is a product that is the first of its kind. No one has made a platform for drones to date, and it takes many different technologies. It takes hardware, it takes firmware, software, flight controls, user interface, cloud tools. It's a combination of all those things that make this platform a reality. I hope that in the future when you look under the hood of any commercial drone, you see the Airware platform.